Hello everyone and welcome back to MC Eternal. We are in our single player world and our drives seem to be off for whatever reason. But, check out this. So, um, I was doing some stuff off camera, which I, I don't normally do, but it, it was more so a, a test. Or, or at least it was going to be, but then I realised it might end up being a, a big task. And so I wanted to uh, a, at least showcase what, you, what I'm going to be doing off camera uh, in between most episodes. So uh, I won't do it for this episode, uh, but I'll, I'll show you what I will be doing. Um, so this setup here, a sink going into a fluid tank. You can see it's configured to uh, pull on the side, so it pulls in the, the water. It, it pulls it in slowly. You can see it goes up like, you know, 100 every so often. Um, that's not uh, dependent on how fast this sink outputs. That's dependent on the tank. So if I do time in a bottle on this, it will actually fill up with water a lot faster. So it's that, that's how it works, apparently. Um, another thing is, we have up here some white concrete powder. I currently don't have this automated yet. Um, I definitely could set up some auto-crafting for that. Um, if we search up um, white concrete, basically it's just some bone meal, some sand, some gravel. Um, we have honestly not that much sand. We definitely are a bit low on sand. And Do I even see gravel here? Okay, gravel's up there. We have a lot of gravel. Um, hmm. Yeah. So th this might be a problem, but um, I I'll get to the point anyway. So concrete powder goes in here. It gets turned into concrete, and it does it quite slowly. But if I slap this on, you should see. Look at this. It starts filling up faster. Starts processing faster. It seems to do it in like waves. It will do like 16 or half a stack, like almost instantly, and then it will have like a little bit of a cooldown. You can see it happen over here. Yeah, it seems to do like 10 or so. And yeah, so, so that's been going off. And the reason for this, and, and and hear me out, is I want to replace all the cobblestone in here. I just, I stood on, I stood on the transfer thing. This little teleporter. Um, I want to replace all the cobblestone here with that. And you might notice the difference already. Um, now I'll try and give an example. I'm not sure if it will actually show on this small of a scale. But, have a look at the quality of everything. Have a look at the quality of when we look around and all that kind of things. And then have a look at the quality when we look around here. It's very blurry, isn't it? Even, like, looking at that door there will look a lot worse than if we have just white on the screen. It should look a lot better if we, uh... Oh, if I can even load in the door. This should look better than when we did it from over here with uh, a lot more of this cobble on the screen. And the reason for that is, it changes colors constantly in this one piece of cobble. It changes colors so much, and when that's added all together, it just looks like a bunch of pixels. It looks so horrible. Um, and I think that for the for the sake of the video quality, I think uh, picking something like this where it's just consistent, it's just the one color the whole way through. I think that'll be a, a much better option, a way better option. Um, and now to do this, I actually made one of these guys. Um, a gentle exchange scepter. Now, it, it works essentially the same as the uh, exchanging gadget. It might have a little bit of a small range. Uh, the only difference is this, I seem to be uh, more comfortable just holding right click and spamming it. And the cobble that gets replaced goes into my uh, dank null because it drops as an item uh, instead of uh, being converted into my inventory. Um, th this guy uses power, this guy uses durability. The recipe for this guy is just some emeralds some uh, iron and a bit of obsidian, so it's not too bad. Um, if I'm honest, I was mainly testing it out to see if it had a wider range, because I wanted to see if there was a better way to do all this, because if we up our render distance, this is where it gets a little bit ugly, a little bit laggy. Um, I was tearing down the wall. I'm not sure if maybe I should replace the wall as well with this um, concrete. I I'm thinking I will. In fact, what we might do... Since this concrete does take a little while, is we might end up walling off. I might like wall off here, and up to like that wall. You, you know what I mean? I might do little sections at a time, for the sake of the video. But, that- Oh, I stood on the thing again! You, you can't script that. Oh my god. And because my render doesn't up, it takes a while to travel. Oh my god. Alright, we're, we're fine, we're fine. Um, I'll do that stuff off camera, but just so that you know how I'm doing it. I did consider cheating? Uh, I was thinking I could just spawn in concrete. It's just concrete, you know. Uh, I could just get concrete. But then I figured um, we've gotten this far, right? Um, I don't think we've cheated anything so far. If 
There, there could have been something, but I'm pretty sure I would have told you guys in a video, so... Hey, if you guys remember that, uh, let me know in the comments. <laughs> I don't actually remember. What would it have been? Hmm. I'm not sure. We, we might be completely legit here. I'm not sure. I don't remember. If it was something, yeah, it definitely wasn't something uh, big. And, yeah, we can do something like this, and if this isn't fast enough... I can set up multiple. It's it's fine. It's fine. And I'll do that stuff off camera. But I I didn't want to do it all off camera. I, I realized that I was getting a little bit carried away. It was going to take a lot of time. I'll let you know in the video. <laughs> video, by the way. Thank you guys for subbing. We've been uh, climbing quite rapidly uh, as of recent. And yeah, thank you guys for subbing. <laughs> that, 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 that's about it. Uh, for this video... Uh, we we do need to do this chemical reactor, don't we? Last episode, we checked out Electra Blobs. Let's, um... Hmm... Okay, let's... Yeah, let's let's try and do the chemical reactor. So, I think what this will entail is me uh, pausing for a bit, trying to figure out what we're up to, and, and I'll be back once I've wrapped my head around this. Alright, we are back. And I think one of the big issues was uh, rubber. Uh, I've noticed we've got this guy here. He's not... Probably automated for whatever reason. I'm not, I'm not too sure why he's not automated. Can we have an output over here? Surely. Does that not work? Output there should go in here. Nope. I, I, I guess not. Is there not even a cable here? We don't even have a cable. What is going on? Um, I'm sure there's a reason for this. Let's get an item conduit. Oop. I keep forgetting to click at the top. Item conduit. Um, we'll we'll, we'll try and get this under control. Um, I, yeah, I need to figure out the best, uh, course of action for, um, extract, always oh, active, for, uh, rubber. Is this gonna work? Uh -huh. 62. No, it does not seem like it's going to. I guess that's why, uh, we don't have a cable there, because the cable didn't really work. That's fine, we'll, we'll, we'll have to decide that. So, I looked at the recipe, right? That's what we've been doing these, uh, past few episodes. We've been checking out the recipe, seeing what we need. Um, there's a lot of redstone. That should be fine. Um, uh, I'm starting to think we could, and hear me out, we could do mystical agriculture for this stuff. Uh, for some of this stuff, right? We could do it for... The glowstone should be fine. We should be able to uh, automate that quite easy over here. We have uh, witches in, inside here. If we turn the, the light on, um, their inventory a little bit. Seems like we have a little bit of an item problem as well. What's that all about? Um, is this guy full? Nope. The mob slaughter factory. Hmm. I'm not too sure. Um, this guy's making witches, and witches drop glowstone. So we should, as long as we turn this guy on, and this guy, he won't be working because we need to have the mob crusher on. Instead of, well, not necessarily instead of, but as well as. I guess instead of. I was trying to get liquid meat because I, I had run out of meat just before. Uh, this has plenty in it, though. We can pause this guy. This guy should start working now. And we should start getting our witches again. So, glowstone should be covered on, especially by the time we actually get to using it. Um, as for redstone, we do have a mystical agriculture farm here. And now this makes infinite, unlimited bajillions of redstone. With that being said... This over here is a much more balanced way to make redstone. One of these plants gives us one redstone. It's nice. <laughs> to be fair, here we go. Here's, a, here's our balanced redstone. I still don't think that's enough. I don't think that's enough that we need. Um, we could slap this guy on and get unlimited. In fact, we probably have essence in here somewhere. Yeah, we have all this essence. Let's convert this essence into redstone and see where that leaves us. You do it like this? You do. We guess you just get so much from it. Okay, here we go. Do this, 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 and this. How much redstone does that leave us at? That leaves us at 840. I think we needed in the thousands, didn't we? What do we have it? Nope, we have it. We only needed 700. Okay, redstone taken care of. Glowstone, I'm pretty sure we'll have that taken care of. Lapis? Uh, we might have a little bit of trouble with lapis. How do we... You know what? We might have lapis ore. Let's, um, let's check. Uh, let's search lapis. Uh, yeah, we have the lapis ore, uh, so we should be able to process this. I assume it should be fine to just chuck over here. Um, I always like to check the uh, chemical, cha the enrichment chamber. 
How much does this give us? That gives us 12. How much does uh, this guy give us? <laughs> Whenever it will be done. 12 as well. Um, yeah, because we can chuck this in here and we'll do it all at once. How good's that? There we go. <laughs> um, I, I hope I'm doing the right thing there. Uh, did we put the... I thought we grabbed the... Did we do the... <laughs> the, um... The lapis. The the end lapis. What am I doing? What is going on here? Lapis. It's gone. I swear I grabbed it. I don't... I don't know. No one knows. Let's grab all this out. Uh, this guy isn't smart enough to, uh... Output things by himself. He, he needs my help. Alright, so I think we have the lapis covered. That's what it's feeling like. Uh, let's... Can we get this done? Come on. Any day now. Almost done. So close. Oh, I'm full. Uh, boo, 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 boo. Alright, so that should be the lapis done. There seemed to be some data thing that um I could have sworn we had automated, but I guess we don't. Is it because it's set up down here? Um, and by down here, I mean in one of these guys that it shouldn't be in. Um, no, it seems to be fine. Let's, uh, let's have a quick look. Try and memorize these. It does look like this missing bit, uh, that's in the chemical reactor. I'll find the actual name, so I'm not just saying this bit. Um, where is he? This guy, the data storage unit, or data storage circuit. I swear we've made a thing for that. I thought we had everything covered. I, I'm guessing, <laughs> I'm guessing not, but I kind of want to double check. Let's also search in here for a pattern. Um, data storage circuit. There it is. So we already had it. And an energy crystal. That is perfect. Um, so down here, these are all full. That was the problem, right? Yeah, so we need another interface. Um, so that should be quite easy. And we should be able to slap this guy here. Go bam, bam. And now let's see what we're after. We should be so close to the chemical reactor. And then we're, we're just that one step closer to going space. And I cannot wait to make a space base. Um, rubber will be a big issue too. Data storage circuit. Data storage circuit. Do I need to place a crafty thing? No. No, I don't need to place a crafty thing. You know, there is a possibility that we're too full on, um... Yeah, can I pick these? <clears> hmm. <throat> can we get, like, a cardboard box? We can. Sawdust. Wood pulp. Pulp. Wood. I've got, I've got an idea. So, I would like to move these elsewhere so that uh, we can better manage them. And by that, I mean have them almost separate from our network. Oh, we kind of can't, can we? Can we? What does this give us? Nothing. <laughs> it's just, it's, it just starts splitting it. Because uh, I, I think the problem is we're using too many networks here. So, we could get a controller. Yeah, I think... <laughs> I think I can get a controller and just slap one here. Um, controller. 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 Future. Controller. Here we go. Bam. Can we make one? We can. Boom. Let's, um, let's just slap one down. What's the worst that could happen? Do we try now? Wireless out of range. Well, that's, that's not too good. Hmm. The wireless has given up. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently. Uh, that is not good. Okay. Um, I, I'm, I'm figuring things out. Is that going to work? Is it red permanently? I feel like red's bad. Is it, it, isn't that what you guys are feeling? Red's feeling bad, isn't it? <laughs> Let's uh, head back over here. Um, where our other controller is. It's freaking out. I don't know if it normally goes this fast, but it's going fast. Let's um. Let's try one of these bad boys. Let's slap this here. Let's dig up this guy. I can probably just wrench him, can't I? Yeah, that's it. Okay. 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 So what I'm thinking is... We kind of double down... Yeah, okay. We're, we're going to do some rewiring here. <laughs> it, it'll make sense. Ish. It, it probably won't make sense. Let's, let's be honest. Nothing I'm doing makes any sense. Right? I'm just doing it. And you guys are just like, oh yeah, sure. Why, why wouldn't that do what he what he seems to think it does? And to that I say, yeah, why wouldn't it do what I think it does? Of course we need these to be, still be uh, coated. This can go here. 
and this can go here, right? <laughs> and then we can write um, chemical. It's not even connected anymore. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Okay, everything's fine. So now this, we disconnect. And we connect here. Right? Right. And now I search chemical. Oh, it's shown back up. Positive. Okay, here we go. So now... The bit that we put in is there. It's th these things, the data storage circuits, they're being autocrafted. The rubber's still a problem. Uh, apparently, we need more. Available 840, missing 560. Okay, so we need a lot more. We need a little bit more diamonds, that's fine. It should be. <laughs> uh, these energy crystals are apparently not on our list anymore, even though I thought they were in the same thing as this data storage circuit. So we're going to have to check that, but progress. And then the emerald plates, the blah, 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 blah. Okay. Energy crystal. That is the first thing to check. Energy crystal. Is that not what we put in this third thing over here? Energy crystal. It is. Um, using sub substitutions. Yes. Um, okay. Okay. So I think the problem there might just be with the chemical reactor recipe. Um, and by that I mean it might want completely fully charged ones. I might be wrong here because we also have Lapidron crystals. Alright, we'll, we'll leave that for now. Let's try and conquer these emerald plates, shall we? So I think to do that we're going to use uh, the rolling machine over here, which we haven't used yet. Um, but we need emeralds, and how many do we have? Not a billion, and we kind of need a billion. Um, okay, did you see that? The end emerald ore that we put in our inventory turned into normal emerald ore. So that is something else to note, uh, <laughs> apparently. Let's see. Um, this can go in here to give us two, or it can go in here to give us two. That's too slow. Oh my god, that was painful. This guy, you know, he can't do it all at once, but he does it, right? And he shoves it back in the system as well. He's wonderful. <laughs> okay, so we... <sighs> okay. Emeralds. Now, I've seen a few ways to get emeralds. Um, one way was with, obviously, you know, you can trade. That's always an option. Um, emerald dust, crushed emerald. Apparently, you can turn it. You can try and laser it. You can just search it in the world gen. Um, I saw someone set up a wheat farm going into a villager trader. This guy, a village trade exchange. Let's bookmark it so that we don't lose it and see if we can craft one. See what we need. We need um, one of these, however we make one. Yep, we can do that. Machine frame. Uh, what else do we need? Oh, we don't need plastic, do we? No, I'm sure we have plastic, surely. I'm sure we have some plastic. Here we go. Village trader or Village Trade Exchanger. Um, hopefully we'll be able to do um, carrots. Maybe... Uh, do we have a farm still set up somewhere? This stuff's still set up. It might be off at the moment, but it's technically set up, I think. Um, try slapping this guy down. Uh, he will need power. So we should be able to hook that up with uh, a flux network. We're going to get back to our power, or at least within range. Ooh. Within range. We go. Um, flux. Doo -doo -doo. We need a point. Um, these are points, right? Right? No. These are saying they're plugs. Are they plugs? They are. We need a point. We need a flux point. Here we go. Here we go. Perfect. Head back over here. Alright, so I don't know how this machine works. I have seen it used before, though. So let's see. Let's uh, just go on network one. I assume that's got all the power. Okay, so carrots go in. Oh, okay. When provided with a mob imprisonment tool with a villager. Oh, here we go. Wait, well, what is it? Oh, 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 oh. What does it say? Um, give me a second. What do we need to trade with the villager? Hmm, okay. So we need a villager. Do we need a village or we need a villager? Let's see, can we get a villager egg? Egg. <laughs> what egg can we get? No, we can't get a villager. Um, zombie? 
Hmm. Alright, here's where we have the problem. <laughs> That's a problem. Uh, Emerald. What are our other options? Uh, I don't think we really have too many options. Um, we could just buy them. We could just buy emeralds. Ooh. Okay. Now, that does seem a bit cheesy. I will 100% agree on that. Um, we could also trap some of these guys. Evokers? Is that what those are? Evokers, Vindicators, Summoners. Okay. So, that's doable. We'd obviously get the Farmer from a village. Um, my problem is, my maps have, have all changed. So, unless we have a village hooked up to this, I don't know where we would go. Um, I think this is a village. Oh, it is. Okay, so let's go to the fear. Let's fly over here. Um, imprisonment. Imprison. Um, these look like they've all got stuff. Imprisonment. We should have unlimited gas tiers now. Yeah, oh, automating the gas. Very smart idea. Uh, you know, just spend one episode, get that done, and oh wow. Unli unlimited gas tiers. It's very much worth it. Um... So we just want to kidnap one of these guys. I think we want them to be a farmer. So I guess we'll look for... A you look a little bit evil. Um, I guess we'll look for a farmer. Or at least someone that has a, a recipe that we can spam uh, sell, I guess. Uh, oh, hey. How you doing? Mr... Oh, they're all sages. Netherwart? I suppose it wouldn't be too hard to set up a netherwart farm. It could be fun setting up a netherwart farm, considering... We currently don't have one. You know what I mean? Just something fun. Uh, Tello? Um, no, but you're not really that good of a trade, are you? Nether wart. You guys like your nether warts. What about you? Do you do coal? Eh, really. You know, like, got bones? I kind of want to bring that guy with me. I think we have a lot of bones. <laughs> uh, let's go home. Wait five seconds. Let's, uh, let's see how this goes. I'd, I'd like to get this set up before I end this episode, uh, because I feel like this will be pretty fun to do. Um, I'll test it here first, then we can move him later. Um, oh, is it not treating this as a, as a villager? Oh, that's unlucky. Alright, let's, uh, let's head back, and we'll set this guy free. Um, we could manually trade with him, all these bones, but um, it's fine. Uh, we'll, we'll be fine. Let's, uh, I want to set up this automation. I want to set this up. I want it to be cool. I want everyone to be happy. Um, our only problem is finding, <laughs> finding a farmer. Farmer, do we want a farmer? That's a, that's the new series we're doing here. Here on the channel, new series. <laughs> Sneak preview. Will he find one? Pro probably not. Because apparently there's no one here. Everyone just sells coal. Or, or buys coal, I guess. Would be the right uh, way to say. Apples! Ooh! You! You're a druid, though. You're a villager druid, though. Okay. Yep. You. Me. Home. That's it. That's how I pick up the women. <laughs> right, I haven't slept in a while, so I apologize for this horrible attempt at, uh, at humor that is taking place at the moment. Um, okay, boom. Apples. Do we have apples? Oh, I bet we don't have apples. Where do you go? Oh, you go there. Okay, that makes sense. So cooked fish? Nope. Apple? Yes. Beetroot? Yes. Okay, beets we can do. Apples we can do. Um, apples if we have them. Beetroots if we don't have apples. Because beetroots we can just replace that uh, that farm there. Oh, this is going to be good. Alright, so. Apple. How many apples do we have? 200? How many beets do we have? We have some beetroot seeds. Let's do this. Let's uh, let's start replacing this farm. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, so what are you? Oh, a lot of carrots. You know, it would be great if we could just get a carrot farmer, wouldn't it? All right, I'll tell you what. I'll be back with a decision. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are, and I am very scared at the moment. Um, you stay there. I pick up you. I was gonna bring this guy back because they said farmer at the start, but then they like, converted it into a shepherd when I got close enough. Uh, so I'm not sure what was causing that. Also, I'm very scared here because this is a 
vampire controlled area and they do not like me being here. Um, but that guy right there, I'm not sure if you saw it. I'm not sure if I showed it uh, on camera. But he has a, a carrot raid. So this guy can go bye-bye. This guy can go hello. And we should buy boom. Oh, here we go, here we go. Alright, uh, we're out of range, obviously. Uh, we got to make it daytime as well in a few seconds. And we should be in business. We should be completely in business. Let's, uh, let's clear our inventory right up. We had to kill a vampire. It was quite, uh, traumatic. But I'm fine. Everything's fine. Let's head back over here. Now, this should just be unlimited emeralds for weeks, months, years even. Um, oh. Does that have to fill up for me to get my next emerald? You know what I think we need to do? <laughs> we need a diamond bottle, this guy. Um, so, yeah. I, I mean, I could just set up a, a... A... A system. A system, yes. Systems are things. Let me get a item conduit. Uh, apparently I didn't have any on me, so we'll keep some on me this time. And we'll get a crate. And we'll just have a nice small crate. And we'll hook this up. And we should have emeralds automated. Right? Should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. I should be able to do this. We should see emeralds. I'll put my one emerald in here. One emerald in. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> what are you doing? What is this guy doing? This. Make. Yeah, this... All right, so this needs some speed upgrades or something. Um, and then we'll have to put a, a filter on this. So I'll do that now. I'm, I'm talking like we're going to do that next episode. Let's stick to our guns, get this done this episode, have a nice finished moment where we all get to sit back at the end and be like, oh, isn't that beautiful? Yeah, whitelist. Only emeralds coming through. Perfect. That's wonderful. Everyone's cheering. I can hear you all. Let's search um, for speed add-on. I believe it's Tesla. Someone said Tesla. Um, oh, let's do at Tesla. Um, speed upgrades? Should we try this? Let's, uh, I want to give them a try at least. Go. I don't recall. So, so I'm not 100% sure. I know that these work for something. I, I don't quite recall what it is. I am using up redstone. Of course I am. Um, hopefully. Speed, speed, speed. Speed. Um, we need another one of these. We need, I think, another gold gear. We need one of these, and then I should just be able to upgrade it like so. I already had some extras. Of course, I did. I probably had everything that I needed just then, and I made them all for no reason. Um, can I do this in there? Okay, I can. I can. Now, can I, on the? Oh, can I open this? Can I do this? And then, can I do this? And then, can we see only Emerald show up? Please, and thank you. Emerald? How's this guy going? He looks like he's draining more power. And it looks like we're not receiving power. So that's good. <laughs> Is it? Wait, why aren't we receiving power? Th these guys are working full bore. We've got plenty of power. I don't, I don't know why this guy isn't receiving. I guess this guy... Isn't asking? Um, yeah, I'm not too sure. Not too sure what's going on there. This is automated, though. This is technically speaking automated. I'm going to see what happens if I chuck this on. On full bore, he's ran out of power. How have you run out of power? How have you run out of power? How, how, at what point did you run out of power? Let's get a, a cable of some sort and see if we can fix this. Yeah, energy. Oh. I, I don't like that it doesn't select up here. Energy, energy. Get these cyclic energy cables. You know how reliant cyclic are. Oh, almost broke the things. Bam. Power. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, so yeah, boom. All of our carrots go into here. They go out there. They're farming non-stop. So these are full of carrots. I think the actual cables are probably full of carrots. Everything's full of carrots. Everything's making carrots. They're all making emeralds. The emeralds themselves, we could just make this an ender chest. Ooh, we're geniuses. We're just going to put it right, right into the system. Get an ender chest. 
And, uh, chest? I typed the wrong thing, so we might have already had one, but it's fine, we'll get a new one. Ah, boom! Fly back over here. We do have an axe, if I'm quick enough. I am. Break this axe, or break the thing there. Click this. Insert on. Emeralds in. These should be put into our system. We should oh, be able to go all the way over here. Check this. Search Emerald. We have 63. You ready? Hey, holding on to your boots. Oh. <laughs> Come on, 63. And then. And then. Bam. What? What? Are you out of carrots? How do you know they have carrots? Oh, he's, he's out of time in a bottle. Okay, okay, okay. So we had 63. We, we, we had 63. And now we have... Emerald. 64! With, with 65, look. See, we're mowing through them now. We're mowing through them. So I could just do that every now and then. If we leave it by itself, obviously, it'll, it'll get through everything. That's all good and well. We are <laughs> one step closer. Um, let, let's check our recipe. Chemical. Let's check. Let's check. Okay, so... The redstone, I might turn on those farms again. Um, the diamonds, we might have to check. Glowstone, uh, we'll keep an eye on. <laughs> Rubber, big problem. Um, energy crystals should be fine. I'm pretty sure this is just some uh, uh, redstone, maybe some diamonds. Uh, chrome ingots, we'll have to check on. Carmenite reactor, we'll have to check on. Emerald plates should be done now. That should not be an issue. We'll just chuck those in the rolling machine, and they should be good, as far as I'm aware. Um... And yeah, I think that's where we're at. Thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please do subscribe. We're trying to get to 900 subscribers by the end of the month. You guys know the drill. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.